Good morning everyone, it's Joker, and today we are back with another slime video. And today we will continue the uh, Groom Rimuru Showcase. This time we're going to take him into Tempered Edge, you know, the event where light teams are supposed to shine. <laughs> Get it? Light, shine, okay, I'll stop. Anyways, this is the team we're going to run, so... Obviously, we've beaten Tempered Edge already. Like, we've used Shizu and Shion by themselves, along with, you know, someone else instead of Rimuru, to clear the stage. So we can beat it. Rimuru is just going to make it that much easier because of his low point cost and his green stacking and orb changing and pierce resistance down. So let's see how easy EX2 is now. We're going to run triple DPS this time. Uh, Gazel's gonna be in front. If we clear it super quick, maybe we'll take Gazel out and bring in maybe Windmillum instead and see if we can get that big, big boosted damage turn. Uh, but that takes a little bit of setup. Maybe a little bit less setup because you don't need as many points than the other team that I use that'll video will come out probably, I don't know, in a couple days? Tomorrow, maybe? Whenever. The, whatever I decide to drop it. it. It's a it's a very similar team, but it has one unit that's different than Rimuru, who does the same thing. It's Ranga, all right? It, it's, it's Ranga. I'm not going to hide that from you. Okay, so what's our first hand look like? Uh, well, I mean, it could have been worse. It could have been a lot worse. Let's go ahead and send these Gazzles, right? Actually, mm, do I want to send the, both the blues? I think we'll send both the, the Gazzles. Yeah, we'll send the Gazzles. Okay, so the whole point of this team is to use very cheap skills quickly. Get that Pierce power up, get that Pierce rate up from Shizu. So we have 44 points now. Um, it's not really what I would call like a great hand, though. Let's go ahead and... Hmm... Like, I'm gonna send these Rimuru's. Do I want to use anything now, or do I want to hold off and send it all on turn three? I think we will send it turn three. So that way we have another 16 points. We have the protection gauge, so we're gonna have a whole hand of greens. And we can use a good amount of 15. We can use four 15-point boosts right now. Four. Yeah, okay. So this will work out. So let's use Shion's Orb Change. Let's use Rimuru's Orb Change. For funsies. Alright, so that's two skills down. And then, do I use... Does Gaz have any cards? He has one card. I could, I could send him last, right? Um... Yeah, let, actually, hold on. No, let's send him last. Okay, so we'll get four stacks right here. So Shizu's up to 90% and Shion is up to 37%. So definitely we could have gotten a little more had we gotten, you know, better starting hand. But this will work out, you know, pretty good. So now we have boosted greens all the way across. The only way this could be even better is if we had a little bit more and we could use Rimuru's uh, Pierce Resistance down and the alt gauge increase by 50%. But again, I want to save that for later down the line. So let's keep on targeting Shion here, and then we'll send Gazel because he's got all his buffs on, and he'll do quite a bit of damage. 6,000 6, on the normals, and Gazel with that 200% boost if he crits, he does almost 20k. I mean, that's a 15 point damage boost to the greens on top of everything else that he's giving himself. Uh, I'd call that pretty good right there. Um... Let's see. Let's get Gazel's ult, then we can send him away. We have maximum points now, but we're out of the stacking phase, right? We're on turn four, so nothing we use now will increase our pierce rate or pierce power with Shion. So, oh, man, we're taking a hit right now. Okay, so I think right here we're just going to have to bite the bullet and do some shenanigans here. Uh, da, 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 da. So Rimuru, let's lower the P 
pierce resistance down from Shion. Let's just get her out of the way. Okay. And then I'm gonna swap him out for Leon. Did I say Rimuru the first time? I think I said Leon. <laughs> I meant Rimuru. Use the pierce resistance down to swap for Leon. All right. And then we're gonna use his light boost. And that gives us 30 points left over. And then we're going to do pierce and full orb change with greens. And now, these greens also are alt boosted because of Rimuru, so 50% alt boost gain, which means that we will have Shion's alt. Mm, I don't think we'll have Leon's alt, but that's not really important right here. And I think we'll save Shion's pierce power, because she's going to have pierce next turn and we can hit uh, Shinsha pretty hard. So let's go ahead and launch Gazzle, and then we'll follow up with everything else. Shion's going to die probably from this one hit, right? Probably from this one hit. So 41.3. Did not die, though, but she will die here. And there she goes. 9,000 from Leon on a crit. And a pierce. Okay, 82. And Shion does 16.2. No crit, but we definitely got the pierce, and that's definitely a lot of damage for a normal. Okay. So what's the hand look like now? Three, a bunch of Gazzle cards. Uh, da, 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 da. Ooh, let's go ahead and bring the hero in for Leon now. And then we can use both the Pierce Power and the Crit Boost now. And then Shion can hit very, very hard right here. And then Gazzle can follow up. Okay, Shion does 66.5. Okay. Okay. Oh, uh, she's going to heal, isn't she? A lot. Well, didn't heal as much as I thought she would. Well, we kind of have to kill her here. So let's bring Rimuru in for the hero. And then we'll... S I, don't, I don't... He's not going to kill, though. That's the thing. That's the thing. Is he's not going to kill. And a counter. He does have an alt now, though. We can go ahead and send that. And okay, another heal. Shion's almost dead. Ooh. Ooh. What can we do here? Yes. I, I like that idea. So let's lower the resistance again. Boost the green gauge. And then we're going to pierce right up again. And another full hand of greens. Again, these are now boosted by the 50% for the alt gain, so if Shion... No, well, Gazzle will get the alt, that's for sure. We'll send him last. Yep, Gazzle will have an alt. Shion's nowhere close, but hey, it's okay. How much damage does Rimuru do? Well, we can watch him propose um, to his... Okay. <laughs> I'm not going to continue that statement. <clears throat> Look, the animation! 19.2. Okay, that's definitely not great. It's not really boosted. He doesn't give himself an attack boost. We didn't have a light boost, an alt, well, a big alt boost, or the crit rate on, so he wasn't going to hit nearly as hard. Gazzle's coming in now. 74 points. And we can definitely lower the crit resistance, or the pierce resistance again, but we could also just use Gazzle's buffs, which I think I'm going to do here now, because he already has pierce on. So let's do that, and then we'll send these oranges, and that should clean up right here. Should, being the key word. There we go, 33.6. Turn 9, though? That uh, that seems kind of rough right there. I feel like we could have done that a bit better. Um. Also, yeah, I feel like that just some bad RNG right there. Although we were orb changing, we had skills. Let's let's try the run again and see if we can change things up a bit. Okay. I don't know if this is a better starting hand or not, but if we can get lucky and just pull two extra greens after this one green, then I guess we'll look pretty good, right? Then I guess we'll be okay. Or okay. Or we can just get countered. Oh, well... 
ask and so shall you receive. All right, this worked out pretty well. Let's use both orb changes. All right, so that's damage up and that is 20% skill point increase. So then next turn, turn three, we're gonna, we're gonna be feasting. And I'm actually gonna take Gazel out for the hero. That way we can maximize our protection gauge that we get on next turn. He's nice, but not the point. So we'll send this, 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 this. Shion's got an ult. Rimuru has barely anything, and Hero obviously doesn't have much going on. But we've got... We're going to have 1.5 protection meter. And then we're going to get even more from Rimuru's trait, and then both Hero and Space Rimuru next turn. So we're going to look pretty good. 87 skill points, so we can definitely use a lot to build up Shion's power right now. And a crit pierce counter, because why not? <laughs> because why not? 10,700 without even the pierce rate. Okay, we're looking pretty good. Let's, uh, hmm. What do I want to do here? I think we're going to do... I think we're gonna rewind. All right, we're gonna bring in Lee. We're gonna bring in Gazel for funsy onesies. Boost this up. We're gonna get him out. We're gonna bring Leon in. We're gonna use his orb change. Alright, so we are up to a guaranteed, and Shion is going to get 43% skill point power. But, I'm also going to use the pierce resistance down, so we're going to be at 45% now. <laughs> Just maximizing every single skill point that we could possibly use. And then we're going to use Shizu here. <laughs> Alright, and we're going to send this. We're not going to send the alt. Not yet. That is 40... That is 50... Ooh, 54 points? Ah, that's not enough. That's not enough to use Leon's light boost next turn. That's unfortunate. Oh, man. Because we already used the skill point gain, huh? Damn. Maybe I should have held on to that instead. But no, it made sense to use it. So do we just go ahead and send this alt right here? I think we do. Yeah, I think we do. We'll see if we can actually kill Shion right here on turn three. And if not turn three, then turn three and a half. We don't really have any other big boosts though. 28.4 thousand damage. Okay, 6,700. It really would have helped if we had that light boost on. 13.1. And now we rewind. Okay. And now... We can light boost. Oh, we didn't even use the pierce power up. That's why. That's why she hits so much less. Ah, I really should have held on to that. That's why. That was a misplay on my part. We're still going to use the light boost, though. And then we're going to use this again. And then we're going to kill Shion. Because she's going to die here. Like, there's there's no way that she's going to live through this. Plus, we'll have another... Oh, we will not have another ult for Shion. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sure. She's super dead. Okay. So, I mean, we got a lot of stacks. Not that we took advantage of it. But that was my fault. <laughs> But, I mean, it'll stay, so we can hold on to this for later. And we only need one card for uh, Shion before she gets her ult. So, it's not uh, the most terrible thing in the world, right? Um, What does Gazel have? He has nothing. Okay. Let's bring in the hero for... No, actually, we'll just do this. Yeah, we'll just do this. Alright. 
three blues. We've got Shizu again. Defense is down, that's okay. Doesn't matter. And then we've got three alts and a full heart ah, and a full hand. Okay. And now we can use the Pierce power. We can use the Pierce resistance. And there's really nothing else we can use, because I don't want to swap out, because we got three alts in a hand. So let's go ahead and use this. Uh da, 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 so alt, 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 normal, normal, normal. Will we kill her here? Will we kill? Leon, I don't care about your ult. 13.8, alright. Rimuru does 19.1, and Xion's come back to life. And Xion herself does 54,000. I'd say that's pretty good, and a counter. Because why not? Does Rimuru actually kill here with a 200% and a pierce? No boost, though. Oh, just not quite enough. Alright, at least she doesn't heal, though. But we're going to kill on turn 6, so that's a lot better. Gazel, you're going to come in for... Um, do, 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 do. You're going to come in for... Rimaru. And the hero's going to come in for Leon. And he still has all his attack buffs, and so now we can just crit boost with hero. And now she's going to die. From these two hits. Guaranteed, right? Guaranteed. Guaranteed. There we go. Okay. Alright, so... The whole point of this team. Small buffs, very early on. Get the guaranteed pierce. Boost up Xion. Don't misplay like I did. <laughs> uh, let's do one more run and see if we replace Gazel with Wind Milum. If we can get that big damage turn going. So hold on one second. Uh, it might. It might take a while. Alright, I think that was enough of the Tempered Edge showcase for Rimuru. He is definitely a support unit with DPS capabilities being single target, but his main goal is to support the other DPS, just like Carrion does for Milim. He does that for Xion. So I think we can end the Tempered Edge showcase for him right here. It was a pretty good showing. We did. I did have a misplay or two in there, but, you know, I'm only human, right? So... He does very well. He fits in very well with the light team, and now with the Jubilee currently going on, he is a mainstay because of his protection trait and boosting greens. Sorry. <clears throat> so, let me know what you guys think of this Rimuru after a few days of using him, and if you did pull for him, do you like him, or do you wish he was a little bit better, or do you wish he did something else? Let me know in the comments below, but for now, take it easy guys, and I'll see you later.